I'm Ashley Angle, your neighborhood reporter in Quincy. City commissioners here are working to get to the bottom of an issue that I've been tracking for nearly a month now. That issue, why former Quincy Chief of Police Timothy Ashley was terminated. Quincy City Commissioners made the decision Tuesday night to have a hearing. The hearing will give City Manager Robert Nixon the opportunity to prove why terminating the former chief was necessary. Our commissioners have the opportunity by charter to make an inquiry into anything that is of public interest. And of course, the transition of a police chief is significant given that public safety is so important. This hearing will also give the former chief the chance to prove why he should not have been terminated. He was sent a termination letter on October 31st. In the termination letter, Nixon highlights that Ashley was not maintaining a functional work environment and that he was unable to manage financial resources to ensure operational effectiveness and productivity. Two weeks later, Ashley told commissioners that, quote, he did not, not know, know why, why he was terminated, terminated and that Nixon's points were vague. He also said his termination was unjust. I spoke with Quincy City Attorney Gary Roberts. He says under 215 in the city of Quincy's charter, the city commission may investigate. Into the affairs of the city and conduct in the conduct of any city department or agency. At the city commission meeting November 20th, commissioners said that they did not get any reasoning as to why the former chief was fired. That's when they voted on an investigation. Despite the former chief getting terminated, this does not mean he will be reinstated. Under the city charter, commissioners are not allowed to be involved with day-to-day -day activities. The only person who can give Ashley his job back is Nixon. It's the investigation and it's gonna be led by our mayor. She's a presiding officer and the commissioners get to question. Nixon says he terminated Ashley because it was what was best for the people of Quincy. He also says he has proof to back up his reasoning. I am the city manager. I do have certain authorities, uh, but I also have a responsibility to make sure that we ensure transparency and accountability. And I will do that to the fullest, even for myself. The hearing is set for December 7th at 6 p.m. at Quincy City Hall. I ran into the former chief himself at Tuesday night's commission meeting and I asked for his comment. He said he'll be reaching out to his attorney in order to give his comment and I'll let you know when I hear back. But for now, in Quincy, I'm Ashley Engel.